Welcome back to our Hardcore Double Hard Keyboard Warrior playthrough on The Division 2. We are now on episode 5, and this time around we are going to do stuff just in the open world. Because we need to try and get to level 7 before we take on American History Museum. So we're going to do Fallen Cranes, we'll go take that control point on. Hopefully we could get a couple of nice bits of gear from here as well. We, we're in desperate need of gloves. Oh my god, can I hit my shots please? Really? Thank you. Oh, I'm an idiot. No, get off fire. Fire, go out. Thank you. Felt like this human torch for a minute. Flame off! Right now, for... Like, in terms of difficulty, and exactly what we are doing, it seems as though this fixed drone's going to be more beneficial, at least from my personal playstyle. We're not even too far into level 5, which is a little bit off-putting. I don't know how long it's going to take. I'm going to pull out the MK-17 for a sec. There we go, boss dead. Uh, we got level 5. Oh. I'm just going to take it all and we'll have a look in our inventory. See... I'm going to lose armor and get a skill tier. They will put us up to skill tier 4. But that just means that my fixer drone is going to give us more armor back. And I'm not... No. No, not doing it. Lose a skill tier, gain weapon damage. Yes, please. For now, at least, anyway. After that entire control point as well, we are... We're not even halfway through. 5112 XP out of... 14 to 50. That, that's not good. That probably means we're going to have to do several open world activities. Just to boost it up enough. Because we got to get to... That's going to be extra XP. It, it's everything for XP at the minute. 155. That's not great either, is it? Ow! I didn't realise that would open up that opportunity to shoot me in the back. I, I don't know how to... Play it. I didn't see that enemy back on the turret. Is that that purple? No, it's another red. Why can't I? Oh, I hate the turrets. They were such a big hitbox. Still not even 6,000 XP into the level. I might have to just go and do a run through GWH. You coming up to see me? Hello. Hello. Goodbye. Risky, 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 risky. I don't like it. Not on hardcore. No, don't even shoot me. Thank fuck for that. What's this? Ugh. We're just getting. We're getting no XP at all. Can I do GWH on a different difficulty? I don't want any more shotguns. Oh my god, they're all they're all god rolled. Are you serious? I don't want the PP19. Every single one out of that box. Are you mad? What's the XP like? I don't think I can can I change difficulty? I can do it on hard. Why is there no XP? There's got to be completion XP, right? See, side missions are fast, but... I, I can't really be bothered with side missions. This is level 5 on hard difficulty. Let's try GWH on hard. I mean, I'm probably just going to cut most of it, if not the whole thing, 
out of the uh, video. I might show the XP at the end and there's a possibility we'll level up. So you might see the filled semi-professional cash. It's going to take way longer to level up than I thought it would. I mean, realistically, we should... I'm, I'm thinking level 6, we go and try the level 7 mission. Because obviously, with that being a higher level than our current, that might award a bit more XP. I can't remember how this game plays. Right, this is hard, so I, I do need to take my time with this. But they're only they're my level, so it shouldn't be too tough, providing I can hit my shots. Thank you. What? Why? Why are you jumping around? Okay, we've, we've made some decent XP progress already. Every single fucking gun. I'm getting annoyed of seeing that orange already. Okay, we're now fighting Saint. I'm hoping we get some good XP. The XP's been alright. We're 11,500 into level 5 now. You're going to jump right up in my face? Fuck off, both of you. I need to crack him. I need to crack him. I badly need to crack him. He's cracked. He's dead. Didn't even notice the XP. And we shouldn't have to wait for Kelso to talk to... Eleanor Sawyer. I was looking at the top left there and I forgot her name. But we shouldn't have to wait because we're not on story difficulty now. Ta-da! Let's check the loot we got off Sane. I've used almost all of my rifle ammo. Trash! What's this green drop over here? Wait for it. Trash! Why would I want status effects? I don't have the vial mask. Right, we're at 11, 8, 20. So once we've uh, taken down these enemies and that stupid door that gets harder with difficulty. Fucking hell, stop running around. What is the matter with you? Accept your fate. Thank you. I shouldn't have to worry about that. That car barely touched me. Oh, come on. Every enemy I get close to killing, I have to reload. I don't get why that door's leveling up with the difficulty of the game. It, it's always done it. I, I don't know why the devs have programmed it that way. I need to make sure it's not overheated by the time we destroy it. There we go. Because then as soon as they start running in... Melt, melt, melt. Mission done. Are you mad? Why are we not getting XP for this? Fuck off. I don't care about the activity summary. Why are we not getting XP for anything? Are there any more? There's a control point over here. 2150 XP. Why did it feel as though we wasn't getting that? Right, I'm going to go take on Navy Plaza. We might do some side missions at some point. I'm not really too bothered, but then if you look at them, they award XP. So, if we do Navy Plaza, and let's get that done. Then we'll do, in the next episode, because we'll hit level 6. Next episode, we will do the American History Museum mission. We'll hit level 7 off that, and then we might, because that'll be... Well, this is episode 5. Episode 6 will be American History Museum. Then episode 7 will be... We'll do some side missions in 7. <sighs> I should not be doing this in the open world, but screw it. Uh, 
It boosts my damage up a little bit. Uh, uh, oh, fuck it. Oh my god. A couple, I think there was a couple of you that mentioned pistols in the comments of previous episodes and I've only just thought to try it and my god. And now you come and join me. If only you would have done that right at the start when it actually mattered. No, oh, I mean 1.1 is not a bloody god roll anymore. Moving up in the world. It's 1.2 though, isn't it? Okay, let's have a look at the XP. Is it more than 19k now? No, it's exactly the same. I mean, once we complete that, we will hit level 7 for sure. Okay, so we hit level 6. That'll be good enough. Because we're only one level behind it. Otherwise, it's, it's going to take those three side missions plus more. And two actually... Oh, wait, no, they've leveled up. Yeah, 58.50. So I might save those. Because if we're leveling up, and they're becoming more XP, whereas the main mission doesn't. So if we take on American History Museum, we complete that, we hit level 7, these will be worth a bit more. Okay, so episode 6, which is the next one for this, like, series, we'll take down American History Museum... I'm going to save the side missions for when it's a, like a bigger struggle for XP. I, I think that's a good way to play it out. We've got a couple of god rolled stats with weapon damage. We've got a nice providence chest to start it off with. If I could get better gloves and a better holster, more along the lines of weapon damage, because I do like my red builds. The fixer drone... I, I don't know if it's more beneficial than the turret, but it's been helpful. And we haven't really struggled. We didn't like didn't lose armor, like full armor, at all through that. What's this going to be? I'll keep that because it's an LMG. If I can't control the recoil, though, then I will just switch back to the AUG if I try the M60. I'm going to try the AUG to start with, then maybe switch out and we'll see. But on that note, that's going to do it for episode 5 of our hardcore playthrough on The Division 2. Let me know your thoughts and stuff in the comments as always. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I will see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.